On May 16th, a little after 6 p.m., a young man and a young woman jumped off the pedestrian bridge over the Clark Fork River. Only the young woman was able to make it back to shore. This is the second day of searching for the young man's body. I just ain't something you play with this morning, especially high water. Yeah. They must have, them guys must be divers, the guys in the yellow suits. The uh, city boat ramp right by Osprey Park must be ICP or at least where they're staging their rigs. So again, for perspective, that's Brendan's Wave, Boone and Crockett across the river, and then the island point here, where most of the search seems to be concentrated. Guy all the way down, jet boat there, buoys of some sort over there, I don't know if that's what that is. And then guys just searching all that stuff on that kind of island point there. Folks at Brennan's Wave. Just kind of hanging out. Lots of traffic around here, like I mentioned. Other people are just hanging out and reading the paper. or playing cards. Life goes on for some. Okay, just completed one lap and right back to uh, where I started, right to this point, which is where I'm assuming they jumped off and now probably Unknowingly, there's a guy fishing right below me. Probably has no idea. Or he does and he's paying his tributes by trying to catch a nice big Clark Fork Rainy for the young kid who died apparently. still searching for his body and this guy is still fishing. We talked about down river, right? This, this is the spot where they jumped off, huh? Right here. Somewhere in here, huh? And what'd you tell me that you, you see him doing it all the time in the summertime, huh? All the time. Yeah? They'll line up in here sometimes four or five at a time from right where me and you were at here. They take turns going over and they get out right here where they're doing the fishing. Yeah. And you know, the water doesn't look that wild, but it is. You know, you wouldn't think it was, but it always does. It's just a shame, huh? It's a dirty shame. I feel so sad for the family of that kid. Can you imagine what they're going through today? I can't. I got a couple kids, man. I'd think about that and that'd just be... That'd be the worst thing be ever. Terrible, wouldn't it? Yeah. Hey, it was nice talking. You to too, me. man. I appreciate it.